I think since the end of season one, when Rob lost Ned, or even before he lost him, you know, Rob always kind of thought about what his father would do in these situations and how he would conduct himself. And I think that carried through second season and now we're at third season. And I think it's kind of settled into Rob a lot. And also he has his own man now. But there's things that I think Rob doesn't even realise. For example, when he is beheading Karstark, the way he speaks to this man, the way he holds his body, the words he uses mirror a lot of what Ned did in season one on top of that hill when he beheaded the deserter from the Night's Watch. And I think that's just one of these things that... There's formalities to these situations that you have to follow. And also, Rob doesn't know what else to do or how else to do it. So he follows what his father would have done and how his father would have done it.